Okay. Um, the the next one is precautions for the eye treatment. Uh, actually, uh, for all the lasers and the many machines, and um, there are precautions. And for the eye it's the same, and mostly related to the skin problem. So let's have a general review about this. Um, for example, like uh, skin cancer or a uh, similar problem like that, like uh, precancerous lesions. And so be careful of that. Precancerous uh, lesions is like uh, melanoma. Um, so with those problems, um, be careful, don't use the eye drop for the treatment. Also, pregnant women cannot do the treatment. Newly tanned skin and also don't do the treatment because it will increase the hyperpigmentation. Be careful of that. Early age of the post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation. Cannot use eye drop. Light induces disease more like lupus, erythematosus, epilepsy, advanced skin infection, purpose who has the, the potent sensitizing drugs and problem and uh, you are using those type of drugs and don't use eye drop. Uh, scar constitution, scar, also history of alloy. Uh, Long-term use of the uh, anticoagulant drugs. Um, if you are always using those type of drugs, then be careful that. Inflammation in diabetics and clients who are using treatments and people who have heart disease, hypertension, hypersensitivity to pain, better than use IPL because when you are doing the treatment of IPL and the patient will feel some painful. If there is no feeling then the treatment results in a good. The last one is the clients with unrealistic expectations for treatment. Uh, better, we are suggesting don't do the treatment for those patients because the pre communication is very important. If you are in your treatment and then uh, after treatment, and the patient will be arguing with you because he's out of the expectation of the customer too much. And so the pre communication before treatment is very important.